Hey, hello friends. Welcome to the Information Security Newspaper channel. Hey, I remind you, my name is Miguel Lopez. So guys, as always, we got two interesting topics. But hey, guess what? If you want to view more of our content, you actually can go to our social media and also to our official website. And you know, over there, we upload more than two notes every day. Anyway, guys, I just want you to help me like sharing the video. And you know, this is helpful for everyone. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, guys, I want you to ask yourself, do you imagine like a world where the police or the army is being attacked, it's being robbed? You know, that sounds like a parallel world. Okay, so today we're going to talk about the cybersecurity company Imperva. So for those who don't know, like yesterday, we also talked about a cybersecurity company, one of the biggest ones, which is PwC. But anyway, this uh, company is still running good. Like they just have like some like difficulties there about their handling of information. Actually, they were fined, but everything is totally fixed. But you know what, guys? Like the topic of today, it's pretty amazing. And you know why? Because it seems some hackers actually take information from a lot of customers of Imperva. So let me tell you guys that Imperva says that they are one of the leaders in cybersecurity in all the world. I mean, this is a huge company and they offer a lot of services. Like they sell anti-malwares, like firewalls, handling of information and a lot of things. So the trouble is that it seems that some hackers steal some information of users. But you know what? This is totally worrying because Imperva has thousands of customers and the specialists mentioned that these hackers were actually hidden inside Imperva systems since the year 2017. I mean, come on, that's almost two years like stealing information. That's a lot of data. And you know, I really feel sorry for the customers of Imperva because you know, for every service, like they pay around 100K dollars. I mean, 100,000 United States dollars for every service, it's a lot of money. I mean, and I just question myself, like, how they manage to do that? Like, there are thousands of employees working for Imperva, like, they didn't notice? I mean, were they sleeping? And you know what? Like, I'm just wondering myself, maybe it was one of their customers or maybe uh, one of the employees? Guys, just think about it, like, who was the guilty in here? Maybe it was an employee? an EXO employee, or maybe it was a customer. Anyway, let's hope that authorities find the guilty. But anyway, this is pretty shocking, guys, because, I mean, we're talking about Imperva, one of the biggest companies in cybersecurity. Like, if they were hacked, I mean, just think about your Twitter account, your Facebook account, your Pinterest account, your Pornhub account, come on. So guys, Always remember, take care about your information. And here are some advices for you and your company. So guys, if you are going to hire a cybersecurity company, a cybersecurity specialist, please just don't go with one option. Like try several options. Okay guys, just think about the security of our country. I mean, we got a lot of types like the Navy SEALs, like the Marines, like the policemen, like the army. So that's what I mean, you know, like try to hire like different specialists. And guys, I know your advice and this is pretty useful. I want you not to lie about it. I mean, if you are stating in your presentations, in your websites, in your social media, that you are cybersecurity specialist or that you have like the best hackers or that you have implemented like the best certifications of cybersecurity, you'll be screwed guys. Because actually, you know, hackers actually take this really seriously. You know, as far as I know, like hackers love challenges. So if you're saying that your company is well secured, they are going to try to access it. So what I mean by this, like guys, just don't state it, like just don't mention it. I mean, it's just for your security, the security of your employees and the security of your customers. Guys, thank you so much for reaching till the end. And remember, if you got any question or any suggestion, please write it down. Also, I want you to help me like sharing the video. And remember, you can go to our social media. We got more information here. Okay, buddy, so see you on the next one.